Danny Hayasaki with Cohen Inc. helping people do their business better. And today I'm super excited because I'm going to showcase the Jabra Panacast camera, the Jabra Direct software, so you can sort of customize or configure the camera the way you want. Uh, and also, we got this cool little guy. So I'm actually utilizing the brand new, it's called the Jabra Panacast Hub. So I have that. This is the USB C version because that's what my laptop is. I have it connected to my laptop uh, via the USB C port. I have this particular monitor connected via HDMI cable. Then I have the Jabber Panacast camera connected via USB and the Jabber Speak 710 connected via USB. So it's kind of a cool little setup. All right, so what I want to show you now is the Jabber Panacast camera. And it's right now at 180 degrees. So you can see like everything and on all my junk and everything is here for you to see. I can't hide it from you, right? And so now we're going to go into Jabra Direct, the software that's absolutely free to download. We will have the links in the description box below. But I'm going to go to device settings. I'm going to expand them all and you're going to see right now it's set to 180. And I'm going to change that. I'm going to go down to 120. Let's do 120 and see what that looks like. Hit apply. So now you can see that the field of view has narrowed uh, significantly down to uh, 120. Uh, and what we're going to do now is just go ahead and shrink it down to 90 degrees. Again, you just go to Jabra Direct down to 90 degrees. Hit apply. All right, so here we are at 90 degree field of view. So you can see it kind of just shrunk everything in. Uh, and this is the Evolve 80. Uh, it's out here because I'm going to do a test later. So. Stay tuned for that. Uh, but again, here's 90 degree field of view and we're going to go and switch it over to 180 and then use the uh, intelligent zoom to see how that works. Instead of seeing the whole entire room all the time, you can set it on intelligent zoom and it'll zoom in on the people that are in the room. Initially it had it so it was automatically zooming in all the time and I guess that kind of gave people, you know, kind of freaked them out a little bit. So they paused it and sort of delayed it so that it kind of does a, a much slower sort of zoom. And so I'm going to change it now to intelligent zoom. And I'm going to hit apply. It's at the 180 mark, but it kind of just zoomed in right away on me using the intelligent zoom. So let me see if I move out of frame. Maybe I'll come over here. Oh, there it is. It's following me. So you see that it starts following me. It's trying to figure out where I'm at and then it's going to hopefully center in on me here. Um, but Again, this is a super cool camera with, in conjunction with Java Direct, it's super, look at that, it, it keeps zooming, it's kind of, oh look at it, it keeps doing it, awesome. All right, so this is a really cool camera. Again, I love the form factor, it's super tiny, uh, tons of power, I mean, it, it literally picks up the entire room uh, with the 180 field of view, and again, with Java Direct, you can customize the setting. Uh, if you like this type of video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, Comment below, let us know what you'd like to see, and we'll do our best to make it. Thanks.